Glaucoma is basically a disease of the optic nerve. The optic nerve is a structure at the back of the eye which conveys images from the retina to the brain so that there's a perception of vision or sight. In glaucoma, what happens is that the pressure within the eyeball becomes too high. Whatever the value is, it becomes too high so that it damages the nerve at the back of the eye. In glaucoma, the nerve fibres within the optic nerve is gradually lost and because of the loss of the little fibres within the nerve, it produces a characteristic pattern or appearance on the optic nerve head which is visible to the ophthalmologist. And this pattern of nerve fibre loss produces a picture called excavation or cupping of the nerve. As you can see, there's an excavation in the centre of the nerve Okay, in a normal nerve, the cup is very small, but in advanced glaucoma, the cup is very large because of loss of the nerve fibre within the nerve. And the gradual loss in nerve fibre will translate to a visual field loss, which can be you know, shown on a visual field test. As you can see in this photo of the visual field, okay, the black areas are the blind areas. And what happens in glaucoma is that there's a gradual loss of the peripheral vision towards the centre, so that the centre visual field is the last to be lost. In a nutshell, this is what glaucoma is. But basically, glaucoma is actually made up of many types, in which the pressure may be very high or may be normal. But basically, the optic nerve is destroyed because uh, it cannot withstand the pressure within the eye.